Hello, I welcome you all for SVK tutorials. In this video, I am going to discuss uh, model question paper 2, which was uh, uploaded by VTU for the scheme 2021. We are discussing the uh, first semester BE degree examination with the uh, subject name Calculus and Differential Equations and the uh, subject code 21 MAT 11. They are going to provide you three hours to answer this paper uh, with the maximum marks of 100. Keep a note here. So this is very much important for you. So the note consider answer any five full questions choosing at least one question from each module. So they will be provided uh, from each module. They are going to provide two questions. So question number one and question number two. So this is the internal choice called as internal choice. You should answer either question number one full means one A, B, C, one A, B, C, question number one A, B, C, or you should answer question number two A, B, C. So that carries uh, each module carries 20 marks. Each mo module will be of 20 marks uh, distributed with uh, 20 marks. So you should answer either of these two questions as one question full with one full question. So in module one, uh, as you know that we are going to discuss uh, differential calculus one. Yeah, they have taken question number one a when you compare with uh, set one paper uh, model uh, paper one, they were provided uh, uh, to prove that usual notation with usual notation tan phi is equal to one over uh, r into d, d, uh, d theta by dr they were asked to prove that what they were asked to prove that with the usual notation tan phi is equal to r into d theta by dr but in this case they have asked uh, radius of curvature in cartesian form rho equal to 1 plus uh, y1 square whole power 3 by 2 by by 2 that's why i told you that uh, this is just a model paper there is there are uh, plenty of way of asking instead of uh, here for Cartesian form, there is, a, there is a chance of asking uh, the polar form also or with uh, uh, proving with uh, radius of curvature or prove with radius of curvature. Question number two is angle between radius vector, uh, angle between two curves, question number two. So this is a compulsory question will be the angle between uh, two curves. Again, uh, uh, question number three is of uh, uh, finding radius of curvature of the given cardioid to that uh, as rho square by r varies as constant. Question number 2a consists of uh, again two curves they have given show that it is uh, intersecting each other orthogonally. Question number 2b contains pedal equation with uh, curve r power n equal to a power n cos n theta. Show that the radius of curvature at a comma 0 on the curve y square equal to a square times of a minus x divided by x is a by 2 which is very important in radius of curvature problem. So I think you came to know how to analyze the question, how to choose the question and how to answer uh, module one. As you all know that uh, module two is of uh, different uh, differential calculus two. So the, in this uh, module, uh, I can say that uh, very much important problems are uh, McLaren series, uh, Jacobian, uh, L'Hopital rule, uh, maxima minima, composite function and uh, total derivatives and uh, proving uh, the different uh, partial differential equation so these are all the important uh, questions in this uh, they have asked uh, question number 3a has been asked by Mo mclaren series question number 3b is given by total derivative question number uh, 3c have jacobian so this is comfortable if they give in this uh, format 3abc you can easily answer this or you can go with the uh, 4a bc as 4a contain uh, l'hopital rule on 4 in um, yeah, you know that uh, three types you are going to study three types uh, of indeterminate forms like 1 power infinity z power 0 power 0 infinity power 0 you are going to study all these problems so this is a the problem then they have given uh, 4b as composite function 4c as extremum values then if i go for module 3 question number 5 and 6 you should answer either uh, from 5 and 6 you should answer either 5 or 6 so question number uh, module uh, 3 can, uh, is nothing but uh, ordinary differential equations of first order 
so here you have compulsory part as uh, newton's law of cooling uh, exact differential equation solvable for p uh, orthogonal trajectory radio exact and reducible to exact all these questions are compulsory part so out of this uh, you can choose uh, any three question and you can answer here so here in this model paper they have asked uh, module 5 as uh, a differential equation whether it may be you should analyze the exact or formulas uh, all these things you should analyze that and you should solve this then uh, this is a uh, newton's law of cooling question number uh, fifth b question number c uh, fifth c is a and seeing this only we can say that it is solvable for p next uh, question number sixth uh, a will be of uh, as i told you that it may be a bernoulli's again a choice like this you may get choice of uh, bernoulli's solve uh, solvable for p or uh, exact reducible to exact one of the question will be there and question number 6b has given orthogonal trajectory question number uh, 6c has given uh, singular find the singular solution which is solvable for p so this is the way of asking uh, module 3 so you can go for module 4 so the module 4 is of a uh, continuation of differential equation with the higher order with the higher order differential equation so they are going to provide uh, homogeneous or non homogeneous in non homogeneous you are going to study three types one is uh, e power ax uh, this is e power ax type 2 is sin ax this is sin ax type 3 is polynomial so out of these three types uh, they, they can ask a minimum one question so you can answer minimum one question from this module then there is a chance of asking variation of parameters variation of parameters and uh, there is a chance of asking Cauchy and uh, legendre here uh, they have asked uh, legendre differential equation instead of this there is a chance of asking the uh, Cauchy. if you saw, saw the previous paper uh, in uh, paper one they have asked uh, Cauchy differential equation so either of uh, this way they can ask uh, in uh, module four so which is comfortable to you you can choose that and answer properly so when you go to last module um, as i told you that it is a very easiest uh, module called linear algebra definitely one question will be there like uh, finding the rank of the matrix then uh, consistency gauss seidel gauss elimination gauss jordan so all these methods and uh, relay spore method will be there all these methods are very important methods so out of this uh, you should answer uh, any of three questions means uh, question uh, 9 or question 10 you should answer so likewise in question number 9a they have asked uh, uh, find the rank of the matrix question number 9b they have asked gauss elimination question number 9c they have asked gauss seidel method so question number 10a consistency question number 10b jordan gauss jordan question number 10c they have asked uh, uh, largest eigenvalue and uh, eigenvector of the given matrix so this is the pattern of the uh, question model paper so in this pattern they can ask uh, your uh, semester end examination anyway i wish you good luck all the best study well so be prepared you have a plenty of time have a plan make a plan how to prepare for the examination and uh, prepare well in advance thank you all for watching this video kindly do subscribe my channel